guys and welcome back to another episode of the Sims 4 Walking Dead Challenge. And we are out here in the garden with Wade as he's um, evolving some of our plants. He's doing really good with his gardening. I think, yeah, he's at a level 5 right now. But he is in the last part of his days, so to speak. Um, i trying to see. He, they, they're keep, they keep telling me I need to get his affairs in order. Oh, it's almost Spencer's birthday. Oh, and Dahlia's birthday. Okay. How is both of them have, about to have a birthday? Okay, she is two days away from aging up, and he is as well two days from aging up. That's interesting. Um, anyway, so this episode definitely need to focus on... Um, oh, gosh, he's sad. Aw. Um, need to focus on getting him... Um, I don't know, just maybe like having some other people take over the gardening responsibilities because, you know, I don't know when he's going to pass. He has quite a few things in his pocket that we could sell. And um, so we need to get all of that together as well. Victor is in here eating some fish that Aubrey cooked because now we could do fish on the stove, which is totally awesome. And look like uh, Spencer is about to grab a serving as well. I'm going to have him do his homework. He's not going to school. And neither is she. Oh, excuse me. I got to sneeze. <laughs> excuse me. Oh, my goodness. Okay. And I'm going to have her do her homework as well when she wakes up. And so, um, oh, and then our thingamajiggies out here got to be fed. Um, I'm just going to have her feed. And then feed this one as well. All right, there we go. So, um, last part, last part, we got quite a bit of good things happening. We bought the stove. We still haven't, oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Is he about to die? Are you serious right now? I was just talking about him dying. Oh my gosh, I think Wade is about to die, guys. Yep, Wade is dying. Are you kidding me right now? Okay. Well, one positive thing about Wade dying from old age is that, you know, the infection, so to speak, did not, you know, get him, <laughs> so to speak, so to speak. So, um, but that's a little bit, I was just, man, I, it, it, it feels like I just predicted this, but I swear I didn't know he was about to die. And Victor's over here eating, watching him dead, dying. Um, that is really, really odd. Um, so death is over here, you know, in any other circumstance, I probably would try to go plead for his life, but you know, I hate to say it. I feel like Wade is probably in a better place at this point. Um, man, that sounds so morbid, but, um, look, Victor's like death is here. Oh gosh. Uh, poor Spencer. Oh, I'm gonna have Spencer come over here. Oh, I don't know what to do. Oh, goodness. Wow, and everybody else is still sleeping. So they're going to be like totally, just totally, I'm going to have him go eat that. Go finish eating, Spencer. You don't need to see this. You don't need to see it. Wow. Wow. Alrighty, well, I mean, you know, I hate to say it. I I, I was just saying that that, that was going to happen. I was just saying it. Um, oh, well, I don't know, guys. I, I really, I'm so, I'm so like speechless right now. Like, I mean, I, it wasn't that I was not expecting it. Um, so it is what it is at this point. Uh, so, Mr. Wade has seen the end of his days, um, and I'm hoping that the things he had in his pocket are in our inventory. Uh, I think I think everything when someone dies goes into the household inventory, I think. Um, I'm almost positive that's what happened. So, when they wake up, we're just going to have like a little funeral for Wade. I guess I can make like a little graveyard over here, maybe. Um Maybe, yeah, yeah, I think I will do that. Um, I'm sorry, my nose and my throat and everything is just going crazy today. I have no idea why. Um, so let's just put this, 
it's weird because this like little area over here is like where the tent normally goes <laughs> but we're gonna put it right here um, let's get some terrain paint here and make it um, oh too big too big too big too big and then we'll get some flowers um, I am so sorry. I feel so snotty right now, and I apologize for that. So let's just grab some flowers really quickly. Um, all right. I think Wade deserves that, and we should probably... I mean, he'll come back as a ghost, you know, so... Um, I'm just going to put on here our... Our fallen comrade. And I'm going to put Wade. Can I put everything? Wade Neely. Is that his last name? I think it is. I think it's Wade. Yep, yeah, Wade Neely. Oh, I spelled Neely wrong. Um, Let's fix the last name Neely here. It's two E's. Alrighty. Oh, no, Neely. All right. All right. So we have our little uh, grave site over there so that when Aubrey, I don't know how Aubrey and Spencer are going to feel when they wake up and realize that, not Spencer, Aubrey and um, Alan wake up. Uh, I'm not sure. All right. I'll just have him go over here and feed. Um, okay, Death, you got to go, dude. You got to go, Death. You got to go. Can I make him leave? Gosh. Um, I'm going to have him go over here and feed the, the two cow plants really quickly. And then, um, man, Wade was just working in the garden, too. This is kind of weird to me, to say the least. It's kind of odd. So when everybody wakes up, you know, I will have us just go over here and kind of do like a little uh, funeral type thing for Wade. Um, did, did he leave? Did Death leave? Okay, good. He like lit our fire and then left. Who does that? Um, so he is working on his homework. Uh, as soon as Trav, uh, what's his name? I keep forgetting his name. Victor is done. I'm going to have him go clean up these dishes really quickly. Um, clean up here. Clean that up. Aubrey is still sleeping. She's going to probably need to. Okay, she's going to be waking up in a second. So I don't know. I don't, I don't know. We're down to five people now. This is quite odd, to say the least. Um, huh. I hate when that happens. Like, you get so you kind of get attached to these Sims, and then when something happens to them, you're sitting here like, um, um. Like, I knew he was going to die soon, but I guess I just wasn't ready for it. I really wasn't ready for it, to be honest with you. I just was not ready for it. Um, okay. So, what else do we need to do today? Let's look at our inventory really quickly. Uh, we need to clean out. I'll have him. I'll have Victor clean out the spoiled food, um, and then we will uh, see what we have in here as far as our fish. Okay, we got quite a bit of fish going on right now. I'm not sure what's spoiled, uh, unless it was some of the fish that spoiled. So he's he's done now, but I want him to like just go kind of. I'm gonna have him go over here and play for a little bit. Um, I'm gonna have him play, play. There you go. Go play for a little bit. And um, he wants to play with a toy box of toys, but I don't think we have a toy box of toys. Um, as a matter of fact, I know we don't. So that kind of sucks. Uh, maybe that's what we need to buy next. Is well, well, he's about to age up. I don't think it's necessary that we get a toy box. Um, so I don't know. I'm like all over the place right now. I don't know. But what I'll have Victor do is, oh, he's crying it out right now. Oh, Victor barely knew Wade, so I'm surprised he's uh, in, in feeling it like he is right now. It's kind of odd. It is kind of odd. But um, we're going to probably look for some more survivors maybe today. Being that we do have an extra bed, we got extra space and everything. So that might be a good idea to look for another survivor. 
Um, so when Aubrey wakes up and as soon as she's finished doing her homework, I'm going to have her go fishing for a little bit. Uh, let's see if I can get way to go water the garden some. And um, we could evolve some of these, but his his level is not up high enough. We can harvest those, though. So at least we'll have some veggies and stuff. Uh, okay, Aubrey's getting a message here. Oh, no, maybe not. Okay. I thought it said she was getting a message. Okay. Not sure what that was about. A phone call, rather. She doesn't know anybody. What could that have been about? Okay. I don't know. You guys saw it, though. All right. So when Aubrey wakes up, what is she going to need to do? She's going to need to... Um, actually, she doesn't really need to do anything, really. So when she wakes up, I'll probably just have her go play around with the... Um, with the cow plants for a little bit and um, I'm just going to fast forward in a little bit. Everybody's hunger and everything is doing really good because of that fish she made. Our hunger is, uh, you know, it does it does better when you have like good meals, you know. Oh, okay. Well, maybe go play with this car, sweetie. Go play with the car and then go hug and talk. Uh-oh. Go talk to, let's tell him a story. Okay, so he's going to do that really quickly. Aubrey, I'm just going to go in and wake her up. As a matter of fact, I'm just going to wake everybody up. Oh, so Aubrey's up now. She knows that Wade died. Um, she's going to go over here really quickly and go play with the cow plants. All right, I'm going to go in and wake Alan up. Okay, he's very sad as well. Oh, but it says he's witnessing death. You, the death is already done, dude. It's already done. So I'm going to have him come over here really quickly and go mourn Wade. Have her come over here and come mourn Wade. Um, Victor is over here. I'm just going to let them two do it, I guess. Because really, they knew Wade the longest. I mean, the kids knew Wade, but it doesn't affect the kids as much as it affects the adults. You know, because it's like they know that their time is coming. You know what I mean? It's, it, I don't know. It's just kind of hard to explain. So... She's going to go over here really quickly. Oh, it's okay. I feel so bad for them because they were sleeping. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to get in here and take a picture, though. Oh, my gosh. This is horrible. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know. It was bound to happen, but, you know, it's just, it's still hard. Oh, my goodness. I feel so bad for them. I do. I, you know, I don't know. But like I said, Wade is definitely in a better place. Um, and, you know, it is what it is at this point. So, uh, Aubrey, what does she need to do? I'm going to have her go help. I know she wanted to help Spencer. I'll, actually, I'll go help. I'll let her go help Dahlia with her homework. Um, let's go help Dahlia with her homework. And they're sitting over there grieving. And what does he want to do? He wants to buy a dishwasher. Um, you know, honestly, we might could do that at this point. Um, we're going to probably have to figure out a way to kind of expand our kitchen a little bit. We got some money, so we could totally do that. So as a matter of fact, let's work on that right now. We'll we'll work on expanding our kitchen. I'll have him come over here and um, kind of work on the expansion or maybe plan out the expansion a little bit really quickly. And... Uh, Dahlia doesn't even know what happened, I don't think. She's not even feeling the blues like everybody else is. Uh, he wants to be funny with Alan. And then he wants to... I don't know how... This always comes up. This take deep breaths, but I don't know how to do that. Let's see. Actions. Nope. How do you take deep breaths? I don't know. All right. Well, let's get in here and let's see if we can expand this kitchen a little bit. We got about 3,100, no, 3,142 simoleons. We could totally take this out a little bit, I think. Um, no, I don't no, I don't want to do it like that. Uh, I kind of, to be honest with you, I kind of just want to poke it out just a little bit here just to make the kitchen a little bit better. So what I'm going to do is just do another room addition. Let's see, I need to do it from the top. It's easier to do it from the top. And then we're just going to do about right. I think that's a good amount. Yeah, I think it is. Uh, okay, let's go back down. 
And then I'm going to just take my sledgehammer here. And actually that might have been too much, but we'll go with it. Let's uh, take these things and move them back. All righty. And then we can um, take our sledgehammer here and go on and, okay, we're getting money. Oh wait, how are we getting that much money? What did I get rid of like that? <laughs> I don't know what I got rid of like that. It gave me like a bunch of extra money. What's up with that? I think, you know what? I think there was lights on there. Was there lights? Okay, there was lights. Okay, let's, um, let's see here. How can I do this without, I'm gonna take these lights and put them back here. Because we are gonna need lights. It's not like we're not gonna need them. And we're not going to get uh, as much money for them if we, and I'm just going to go on and keep that. And then I'm going to take this and move that back there. Now let's sledgehammer it. I was like, why are we getting so much extra money? That's still quite a bit of money. I'm not sure why. I can't, nothing to delete. Okay. And well, that's odd. All right, let's take that and move that back. Oh, you know what? I might can't delete it because the stairs are attached to it. I'm thinking so. I'm thinking that that's what's going on with that. So, um, okay, that's fine. I'll just leave it like that. So let's finish up these walls really quickly. All righty. And then we're going to do that there. And then I'm going to go on and finish the outside here. And then um, here and here. Alrighty. Um, it's not like the best, right? But you know, I mean, I think you get the picture. Um, I can't really do too much about the stairs. The most I could do is um, now it looks kind of stupid because it's like it's got this weird hallway right here. Uh, let's see here. What can I do? Um, I need the stairs. I definitely need the stairs. Maybe I should have had it come out this way. I'm not sure what I should have done at this point. Uh, okay. I think we're just going to leave it like this. I, um, kind of feel like it's dumb. It looks kind of weird. I know it's not going to be perfect and that's fine. Uh, it just, it looks weird. Oh, okay, game product is locked. Okay, I gotta unlock those items, but that's fine. You know what, I don't even know how much that stuff costs. So let's just get some regular, schmegular <laughs> type counters here. Um, I don't know how much these are. How much is this one? 330, golly. It doesn't have to be, how much are these? 150. It doesn't have to be, um, as a matter of fact, no, I'll go on and keep it. Um, I'm about to say it doesn't have to be super duper just great. You know what I mean? It just needs to it just needs to work. Um, so I'm going to actually put. Do we need more counters? Like really? Okay, okay, okay. I got this. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness! I feel like this episode is going to be such a waste, and I apologize in advance for it because I do feel like it's just going to be a super big old huge waste of time. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put the stove in here because that makes sense, right? And then I'm going to put these right here. You know, it's okay that our cabinets are kind of mixed match because when you think about it, um, you know, we just got the materials that we got. You know what I mean? It, it, it just is what it is. But let's go ahead and get them a dishwasher. I think that will help a lot significantly with, um, some of the, I kind of want to get like a dirty, old, dingy looking one. Uh, <laughs> one that looks like they found and, and came and just like fixed it up. You know what I mean? All right. So I think that is actually pretty good. So we got a dishwasher. Um, we got a nice refrigerator. We got this extra kitchen space, I guess you could say. All right. And then now, oh, no, I did not mean to do that. Nope, I did not. Um... Okay, I'm just going to have to physically go add each one here. Um, all right, so we got our little expanded kitchen. Uh, I'm trying to think. I guess I could put another counter here. 
All right, so we got another counter there. I'm not sure we're gonna do it all these little counters here. <laughs> that looks so funny, but you know, it works. I'm just gonna say that it works because technically it is what it is. Eventually, I guess I would like to get rid of this. And um, you know, we could get rid of it now. I just don't want them making bar drinks and stuff. Wow, that is a lot of money. But we're gonna go on and do it. Uh, we're just gonna use it to get uh we're just going to get some counters here. So we still have that counter feel. So that way whoever's cooking can kind of put the food up here and then they could all partake in the food. All right, Alan. So let's go try it out and make sure everything is okay. I'm going to have Alan just do a little bit of walking around over here. Oh, Alan, Alan, go here. Make sure he can do all, make sure he can walk around a little bit here. You know, I know you're sad. I know, I know. Okay, so he can go here. He could definitely, let's see if he could open this up. I know, man, I, I know he could open that up. Okay, so I think we're good to go. And really quickly before I um, just check our inventory really quickly and see if that the stuff that Wade had in his pockets, because I knew he had some frogs and I knew he had some, um, Okay, what is going on? I knew he had some frogs. I knew he had some crops. So I just want to make sure. I forgot to check and see if that stuff was in the inventory here. Okay, hello. Hello. Okay. All right, let me check that and I'll be right back. All right, everything was in his um, inventory. So I'm just going to, I pulled everything out and some things I sold. So we're now, we're close to about 4,000 simoleons. So I'm going to have him put these in his inventory here. No, just put it in your inventory, put it in your inventory, put it in your inventory, and put this in your inventory because we're going to go into breeding the frogs and kind of seeing that that can help our finding. I know, he's like so sad right now. Um, Aubrey is over here helping Dahlia with her homework, and I am going to get Dahlia to do a little bit of fishing today, and maybe we could go out as well. I kind of feel like we do need to go out, but then I kind of feel like maybe we wouldn't today. It's like a really sad day for everybody. It's it's really kind of upsetting. Um, so let's try to get them just to work on some of their whims. Um, he wants to be friendly with Aubrey and he wants to fertilize a plant. Uh, I could definitely get him to do that. Let's go, uh, can we fertilize? We fertilize with... Let's just fertilize with bluebells just to have him do that. And then I'm going to have him come over here and be friendly with her really quickly. We're just going to go brighten her day. And then she wants to do some things with him. Dahlia would like to fish for an hour. So we're definitely going to get her into the fishing in a minute. And she wants to plant something. Doesn't matter what. Spencer wants to be funny with Alan. Um, so I'm going to have him go down here really quickly. And go be funny with Alan. Um, it's going to be hard for him to be, oh, see, yeah, he's too sad. Okay, I'm going to go complain about my problems then. I don't know how you breathe. Click on the selected squeamish sim and use take breath. Okay, wow. It doesn't give me that option to take breath, so I don't know. Maybe maybe he has to be squeamish at the at the time. Maybe I don't know. We're just gonna exit that out. And he wants to play an instrument. Aw, we might have to buy him an instrument. I was thinking about buying a um a woodworking table. I think that that would be a good idea to get a woodworking table. We'll do that off camera because I don't want to waste any more time. But Dahlia would like to get to know Alan. So I thought Dahlia Aubrey. <laughs> I'm getting all my people confused. I'm going to have her ask for some advice and then have her get to know him a little bit here. Get to know. She's super sad. I mean, you know, she's mourning and she's just missing, you know, her friend and everything. Everybody is just like really just out. Okay, so Dahlia, stop, 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 stop. You can't, you can't touch that, son. You can't do it. All right. All right, so we got that, and then she wants to help Spencer with homework. Uh, she wants to woohoo with Alan. Okay, that's a very interesting uh, situation right there, but we can take care of that. So, oh, wait a minute. Oh, my gosh. 
That is Nicholas. Okay, so this right here is Aubrey's husband. Where is he at? Okay, does Aubrey even know? I'm gonna give him. We're gonna we're gonna have to go sit there and go look for her husband now. He clearly is out there. Wow, that is quite interesting. Um, I don't know if we should still go woohoo with him or not. Uh, she's probably not gonna even want to at this point. Yeah, she doesn't. She's too sad. Um, wow. Okay, I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> that was her husband. So her husband is clearly out there. He wants to uh, cloud gaze with her and probably do something in the garden. Level up on the garden skill. Okay, we could do that. Um, I think Aubrey definitely needs to reach out to her husband. Um, I'm going to... Let's see here. I'm going to I'm going to chat with him really quickly and just ask him where he's at and see what's going on with him. Um, of course, Alan would probably be a little bit weirded out by this right now, so I'm going to have him come over here and just do some gardening. Have him do some evolve. Oh, no, not go here. Um, have him do some evolving and stuff here. Let's go evolve. Hopefully when we evolve all these plants, they'll stay evolved, if that makes any sense. Um, and then we'll just go harvest some and go evolve. Um, and Victor is over here. Oh, I say Victor is over here frozen. What is going on? Okay, he wants to be friendly with Alan. So when Alan gets over here, of course, Alan is not... Um, Oh, okay. I'm going to have her go feed. I thought we just fed these things. Oh my gosh. I'm telling y'all, I want to get rid of these cow plants. Like, no kidding. Um, Victor, okay. What in the world? Oh, so Nicholas wants to come over. Yes. Oh my gosh. Nicholas wants to come over, guys. So let's just go ahead and do that. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm like, this episode. Oh my gosh. This is like... This is killing me right now. Okay. So Victor wants to be funny, I think. What was it? He wants to be friendly. I'm just going to have him ask about his day. Um, Let's go do this really quickly. I'm going to have... Uh, let's go unlock. Let's go unlock the doors here. And then we're going to go welcome... Um, and there's Nicholas. Nicholas made it. Oh, my gosh. So let's go over here really quickly. And um, complain about problems. We need to definitely give our dad a hug. Um, ask about his day. Ask him where he's been. I don't even know if Aubrey knows she's he's here yet. Um, and let's hug. And I think, is she coming? Oh, my gosh, guys. This is totally, totally interesting here. We're going to lock door. Um. So Aubrey's over here. She didn't even see him come in. So we definitely need to go over there and give him a uh, a hug and everything. Um, let's discuss interest and let's let's express admiration. She needs to tell him that she misses him so much. She didn't even know if he was okay. I mean, this is crazy. Um, but if it wasn't for Wade dying, I don't even know if he would have reached out to us. Oh my gosh. Look at him. He's like filthy, dirty, just been out in the, in the, just been out. He's been out and just, I mean, this is crazy. But that is her husband. That is her husband. Wow. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm like. So shocked right now. So um, this episode has totally just thrown me for a loop, so to speak. And now her phone is ringing off the hook. Okay, Wade is sending her a text message. Okay, that is just like creepy beyond creep. Um, all right, is she finished fishing for an hour? Okay, I'm going to have her come in here and just grab something to eat. Uh, she's going to get... Uh, 
probably a plate of fish. I think that's all we have in here at this point. So we're going to grab a serving of that. And um, then she needs to also use the bathroom. And I'm just going to have Aubrey just, she's just going to spill like, where have you been? What's been going on? How you come now and just, you know, talk to us. And then, of course, poor Spencer, he probably doesn't even understand what's going on right now. Um, let me just have her going to go. And then we're going to go in and open this up. Let's drag all of this fish in here. Uh-oh. Okay. I don't know if we could do anything with the goldfish. Uh, technically, I don't I don't think that we can. Uh, then I'm going to have her go use the bathroom. And she also needs to go take a shower. So I think at this point, um, oh, Victor's in here. Victor's probably like, what is going on? I'm going to give a friendly introduction to him and then have Aubrey come, I mean, Dahlia come give a friendly introduction as well. Friendly introduction. Alan is over here. I don't know what Alan is going to feel like at this point because, um, you know, the whole, it's kind of an odd situation at this point. I mean, the woman he's in love with, his, her husband just came back home. Um, so now it's like doubly, doubly sad, I'm sure. I'm going to have him, um, and I do need to make Aubrey fix food for everybody. So I'm going to have her go over here really quickly. And um, what can we cook? Let's see what we could cook really quickly. We need to use fresh ingredients, of course, for everything that we cook. So we could do fish tacos. We got fish and we got vegetables. So I'm going to have her do a uh, party size of that. And then she's going to get the cooking. And hopefully everybody can get themselves a really good meal, including Nicholas. So we need to just go on and add Nicholas to the family. I'm going to just go in here. We're going to, um, how can I do this here? I need to add him to the family because he clearly is not going anywhere at this point. So I need to add to family. All right. And now he's a part of our family. So, all right, guys, I'm going to end this part here and uh, definitely we'll see you guys next time. A lot kind of happened in this episode and then a lot kind of didn't happen in this episode. So I, I'm feeling like all over the place at this point. So hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.